Baptist Church. It looks like they have a new target pretty much in their sights and just so happens to be video game related. As a matter of fact, it's gamer related. Gay gamer related. Interesting. So homosexual gamers decided to get together and have literally their own little convention. So that'd be pretty cool for them. That'd be fucking awesome. Bunch of people with the same exact interests and likes come together and have a blast just playing a bunch of fucking video games and whatnot, high-fiving each other, and what the fuck ever. But, just so happens Westboro Baptist Church t doesn't really like this idea whatsoever. As a matter of fact, are uh, already planning to picket this even though it isn't even 100% confirmed. And they've already went out of their way and decided that they were going to go and just attack this outright like they have so many other things without much rhyme or reason other than the fact that they're all fucking mental. And they're literally one of the most hateful fucking groups yet, uh, what's that? Love thy neighbor? Well, love thy neighbor, assuming that they fall into line and agree with everything that you fucking say and think. So, <laughs> we have that. But, uh, they had said a couple of very interesting things. And when I say interesting things, I mean really fucked up and you ought to have your fucking face caved in type of thing. So, allow me to go and elaborate. Now, one of their main quotes that they've been getting a lot of shit for is, and I quote, we need yet another area of life where fag filth is intentionally called out and crammed down our throats, question mark, unquote. Oh, and, and then we have uh, this little ditty. Phelps Roper decided that he would tweet, quote, what we've all been longing for, a fag-focused gaming convention with a little exclamation point with the hashtag of must pick it. Gotta love that. And that's one of the church's members too. So yeah, GamerCom, which has been trying to get a Kickstarter going and successfully did, to try to make this a reality that they can all, all come together, uh, it is basically going to have to deal with a bunch of mindless fucking hate-filled dribble. And, and you have to love that because we also have to keep in mind that this is also the same exact focus group that decided that they were going to go and... <laughs> Go to individual uh, funerals uh, of, uh, of fallen soldiers, and because you know they're homosexuals, and decide that they were going to pick it and uh, mock the fucking fallen soldier, mock their life, and mock the family, and a bunch of other things. And the only thing that really comes to mind is I cannot really fathom. It, it, it actually boggles my fucking mind. How none of you have had a fucking bullet put through your goddamn head. It really does. Because, to me, believe what you want, think what you want. You, you want to go and believe in God? That's fine. You want to go and believe in the trees and the stars and the ocean and grass? That's fine. You want to go and believe in a shrine that you've made to some kind of deity? That is fine. You want to believe in nothing? That's fine. Who gives you the right to tell everybody that what they believe in is wrong, what, what they think is incorrect, and that they are bad people for doing this, and that they should be scrutinized publicly and attacked for doing this, and especially a bunch of people trying to come together just to play video games. You have to be fucking kidding me. The fact that they're all homosexuals just playing video games together? This suddenly is a bad thing, right? You know, if they were off in some kind of lavish fucking mansion doing this, well, what are you going to do? Come onto their private property and, and attack them? <laughs> the irony is that they probably would. It fucking sickens me because I have gay friends. I, I didn't suddenly just catch on fucking fire. I have Christian friends. Again, not catching on fire. I'm, I'm not fucking weird for that. Okay. I have gay friends that have Christian friends, and Christian friends who have gay friends. You want to know what? Who the fuck cares about all that other shit? It's just about individual personalities and how you get along and interests and things like that. It, it, it pisses me off even more because I have... The Christian friends I have actually look at and like, they make us actually look bad. Because they do shit like this. You know, and, and I, I honestly feel bad. In that kind of sense, because, you know, when you have just a few numbskulls who go out of their way to go and spread this kind of venomous hatred all the time, 
as a whole, it, it reflects on everybody associated with it in the mass media. It just, it, it fucks up my head. All I can say is, I, I want them to have this convention. I want them to have a good time. And I want to ensure that <laughs> these motherfuckers don't ruin it for them because they don't deserve that. I mean, how, how would it feel if the situation was reversed? Let's say a bunch of churchgoers decide that they were going to have one of their much nicer, much larger churches, and they were going to have a video game convention there, and that everybody's going to get together. And just imagine if a bunch of, like, atheists and Satanists showed up, and basically showed up with flamethrowers and fucking upside-down crucifixes and shit and pentagrams. How would you feel that they were attacking you? You wouldn't feel too good. You'd feel pretty pissed off. And you wouldn't like it at all. Hell, how would you feel if a bunch of homosexuals came down and started attacking you in retaliation to that? Who the fuck is going to win in the long run? Are you going to fucking feel better at the end of the day that you ruined a bunch of people's times, that you made them fucking feel bad, and just overall made yourselves look like a bunch of fucking monsters? All you are is a bunch of mindless fucking chrome dome pieces of shit that are just attacking people because they have beliefs and feelings and emotions and just overall a different fucking lifestyle than you that doesn't coincide with yours. Fuck you. Fuck you, for, literally, from the bottom of my still beating fucking heart. Fuck you. I, I, but, it, you know, at, at the end of the day, as always with many of my videos that are topical on anything, I am kind of curious, how do many of you feel about this? Do you think that it is right? for them to be scrutinized and, and attacked and everything like this, and to basically be sub, just basically the subject of all this fucking terrible shit. Do you think that's okay? You know, maybe you are going to be one of the people that actually finds this to be absolutely okay, and that this is a rational train of thought. Maybe you will think it's okay. It's a free country, and everybody's entitled to her opinion, but I can say this, if you are one of those few people and you do think this is okay, and that this is, in fact, a free country, the irony is that you're you're trying to stop them altogether from doing something, so it doesn't make it very free, does it? But you are free to go and comment. Everybody is. Comment down below in the comment box. Make a video response, because with something like this, this is one of those deep-rooted issues that can go on for a long time and just basically branch off into other topics and everything. But just keep in mind, this is an attack on religion. This is an attack on Christianity. This is an attack on churches. This is an attack on anything, except for this group of people that really finds it necessary to go out of their way to be the ignorant assholes that they are. And that's really what it is at the end of the day. Just mindless ignorance and hatred. For the sake of hatred and for the sake of ignorance. And, it, you know, they, they feel very entitled to their opinion and that's all good and fucking merry, but quite frankly, I just don't agree with it at all. That's why I made this video. And all of you can make your videos too and follow up on this. Information is down in the, info, it, you know, the information section, the links and whatnot, so you can go and check it out, but, uh, yeah, thought I'd share my opinions, so, I'll conclude this, like always, nerds, nerdettes, and gamers, and gay gamers, game the fuck on.